<laughs> You're in this for the long haul, Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> I don't want to be Abraham Lincoln anymore. <laughs> Suggested listening for this chapter, Bestial Moans by Abba Zagora. I'm listening to it right now. It Are is you? pretty metal. It is pretty yes. metal. It's pretty shit, but it's pretty metal. The tales and songs of Lincoln's unrivaled patriotism echoes in the collective minds of all Americans, such as how he single-handedly slew Osama bin Laden and his entire host of undead Al-Qaeda warriors at the Battle of the Emancipation <laughs> Proclamation. <laughs> Holy shit, the music makes this far better than it should be. <laughs> yes! I agree 100%. But for many patriots, Abraham Lincoln's most legendary achievement was that was when he consecutively fucked 10,000 virgin grizzly bears to death. Thus resulting in the <laughs> extinction of all bears in the America first. Such as a whole <laughs> So he literally fucked all the bears to death! Virgin grizzly bears, mind you. I don't want to be- Bros, Russian bears, now gone thanks to you, Abraham Lincoln. We oh. will- <laughs> <laughs> We will curse our head upon you. Stand with your chin held high, still a stone, Sonic of Hedgehog Clan. You are a descendant of Washington. You bow to no man. On the stage spoke with a wise and fair voice, his gleaming eyes seemingly peering into Sonic's soul. How do you know my name, Kurt Peeler? And more importantly, how did you survive the Ameripocalypse? The bloodline of the patriotic demigods was wiped out over an eon ago by oh. communists! It was fucking brutal! Sonic inquired, boldly testing Lincoln of his godhood. Abe Lincoln let out a small laugh. I'm fucking Abraham Lincoln, that's how. Honest Abe stroked his feathers of his noble eagle steed whilst feeding it a still-bleeding communist heart that he found strewn upon the ashen grounds. The Americaverse needs someone like you, Sonic, a fiercest defender whose heart yearns only for the godless, kinky love of Lady Liberty. Lincoln spoke aloud with a commanding yet soothing presence. He turned to Sonic and smiled. After I was mortally wounded and nearly slain by the communist general John Wilkes Booth, over a year ago, I dedicated myself to assembling a task force of patriotic sounds to destroy Karl Marx's Nelly. followers. We call ourselves the Biker Brethren, and I want you to join us. Lug rail splinter, I ain't your resistance member. I'm not gonna risk my life and loins for your butter churner and bullshit. I slay the fuck out of communists when I can. How else is a red-blooded American supposed to rub one out? Ah, I'm a simple man. I like heavy metal and chicks with big hooters. Sonic, Sonic scoffed. scoffed. You cheating asshole. He then mounted um, atop his motorcycle and drove donuts around Honest Abe and his giant eagle while shamelessly rocking out to screamo metal. Despite Sonic's oh, hollering oh, oh, oh. and fierce <laughs> ignorance, Lincoln couldn't help but be impressed by the hedgehog's unadulterated patriotism. Sonic's tossbed antics came to an abrupt halt when a flaming arrow pierced the front tire of his Harley setting his vehicle ablaze like a mighty squib. Sonic fell to his knees, choking back tears for his inanimate brother-in-arms. A dead silence fell, and Sonic's gaze shifted towards the baleful sodomites that committed this detestable act. Thousands of attack velociraptor... <laughs> Damn it. Thousands of attack velociraptor... Velociraptor... Shut up! Da, 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 da. <laughs> Clever girl. Thousands of attack velociraptors circled their location, and atop them rode heavily armed terrorist soldiers entombed in robotic exoskeletons. Leading this pack was gar was a gargantuan hell beast, surely spawned from within the most unholy depths of communist space. It was a prehistoric creature of the genus <laughs> of the genus Communisaurus Rex more widely known in the common tongue as a big fucking monster. That, that's a beautiful sentence. Upon the scale blazing colossus stood, do stood dozens of communist battlements and bulwarks, each sewn into its skin and teeming with turrets manned by countless unwashed 
Marks is fucked, Lords. It's been a long time, Abe. You think? It's been an entire age since we've last crossed paths. How's that kid of yours? Dead, I hope. A mysterious warrior cackled saucily, swaggering forth with an intensely animated hip and groin movements, while training his sniper rifle between Lincoln's eyes. The weathered Saiyan battle armor and matted yellow fur of this foul mercenary made him almost unmistakably unmistakable for any wizened patriot. For, for him stood Mercenary Poo, the deadliest assassin in the America verse. Wait up, Poo. Wait up, Poo. Gonna fuck up all of your shit. He's Mercenary Poo. Mercenary Poo. The biggest fucker up for around. Once he was but the simple excrement of an undesirable hellhound, a lesser demon known as Christopher Robin used black magic to breathe unholy life into him, earning him the affectionate title of Pooh Bear. In an act of defiance, Winnie the Pooh slew his master, slicing his head clean off and devouring his remains. After that day, Pooh devoted his life to the occupation of a hired assassin, charging an exorbitant, f exorbitant fee of 50 million bars of latinum for each hit. His deadly skills were instrumental in America's defeat in the communist wars, for he was hired by Adolf Hitler to assassinate the founding fathers. <laughs> you ready? Yes! Ne yes. Neither am I. Mercenary Poo unsheathed his chainsaw guitar and lunged towards Lincoln. Sonic nice! swiftly intervened, clashing guitars with the dest detestable sodomite. The hedgehog countered with a graceful roundhouse kick to the jaw, knocking out several of Pooh's ivory fangs and sending him limply flying backwards like a rag doll. You, you got them, Baka? It's been 10,000 years since the blood. Oh, great, I'm going back to Rush. It's the blood of Winnie the Pooh, the greatest assassin in the galaxy, has been spilt. Now I'm going to slice your love handles with my lit. Linoleum. Lit. 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 lit no. Linoleum. Knife for that. Oh my god. And then he's gonna come into your house and tear your wife in half. Apparently. Pooh spat in a fit of blind rage. He raised his paws, signaling for his Velociraptor cavalry to charge, to step in and smite Sonic and Lincoln. <laughs>